Here's a quick tip for you, and this is how to remove the background on any logo, sketch, signature, anything that is in general black ink or text on a white or semi-white background. Uh, seems to be something where a lot of people try to remove the background and when they're done, they see a little hint of the old background still clinging to the original. Well, we're going to completely avoid that. So let's take a look. So here I'm starting with an image where I drew something on a sheet of paper and the paper was not even close to white. So this is a more challenging example. And here are the steps I'm going to go through. First, I want to select all because I want to be able to copy this. So I'll select all and then edit copy. Next, I'm going to turn on quick mask mode. You can do that at the bottom of your tools panel, just below your foreground and background colors. That's this icon here. Just click it or type the letter Q, which is a shortcut for it. Now you won't notice anything happened when you did that but it is now ready for me to paste what we earlier copied. And we pasted it into the thing known as Quick Mask. Now we're going to adjust that. Let's choose Image, Adjustments, Levels. And in Levels, you're going to usually, when you have a sketch, find that there are two humps here on this histogram. What we want to do is grab this slider here and move it to the absolute end of the first, the far right hump right where it bottoms out. That's going to cause the paper material to disappear, even though in this case, there's a lot of texture to it, whereas most of the time this would be much skinnier and further to the right. Then we're going to take the slider on the left and we're going to bring it over at least to the far right edge of the tall part of the other hump. That's going to force the actual sketch lines to become black. And after doing that, we can just click OK. And right now we have the exact opposite of what we need because the areas covered in red would not be selected. So let's choose Image, Adjustments, Invert. That's going to give us the exact opposite so the red will switch to the opposite area. And if red indicates what's not selected, then what's not red will be selected. And that'll happen the moment I click on the quick mask icon over here at the bottom of my tools palette, or I type letter Q to turn off quick mask mode. And now we have a very precise selection of this sketch, which could just as easily be a logo or a signature. But then I don't suggest you use that to delete the background. I suggest instead you go into your layers panel, you go to the bottom to the adjustment layer icon and choose solid color. Then you can choose whatever color you want your sketch to be in. Or in my case, I'm going to choose black. Click OK. And then finally, throw away the original so there is no hint of it whatsoever. And therefore, there will never be a hint of the old background clinging to the edge of this. Instead, the only thing there can possibly be in this layer is whatever color I chose when I made that solid color layer. Now, on occasion, when you're done, you might need to fine tune it. And if you do, in your layers panel, click on the rightmost side where that little layer mask is so that it has its corners highlighted. And if need be, feel free to come up here and adjust this with levels. In levels, if you bring in the right side here, it's going to cause more areas to show up as a solid color. So if your sketch or signature looks a little broken up because maybe you drew it in pencil and it varies in brightness, you could bring this over to get more of it to be solid black. Or if you see more of the background still showing up because there's a little bit of paper texture, then bring in the opposite slider. Just try not to bring them in so far that they are almost touching. If you do, you're going to end up with a jagged edge where it's crisp instead of smooth. But that's all you need to do to remove the background on any logo or sketch. That's all you need to do to remove the background on any logo, sketch, or signature where it's black text on a white background. Quick mask mode is the key.